Pam 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 pam. It has been told that on the scorching sands of Morocco, a child was born, a child that was destined to be one of a kind. His name was Shams, seeking to reveal the secrets behind everything, as if there was a big mystery behind it all. Since he was a child, he loved nature. He was adventurous. He grew up in the hills and fields of Tanja to become a young, happy adventurer. Oh my God, what is this? <sighs> What's happening? Oh my God! Oh my God! Save me! Oh! Oh my god! <sighs> my god! Oh! Ibn Battuta saw this dream more than once. And each time, he would hear at the end of the dream. Please, Ibn Battuta, What are you looking for, son? Do you plan on traveling? Yes. Uh, no, no. Perhaps. I, I don't know. <laughs> if you're holding maps in your hand, then you are planning on traveling. But you will definitely leave. Maybe it will be tomorrow or in a year from now. Yes. Maybe it will be a year from now. I don't know. Is that true, son? Mm, I think so. Yes. But, son, I see in your eyes the excitement of someone traveling soon. What's the matter? Uh, nothing, father. Nothing's the matter. Don't worry. Then eat your soup before it gets cold. All right. Okay. Father? What is it, son? I've decided... I've decided to travel. Wh what What did you say? Travel? But why, son? What traveling are you speaking of? What about the job that awaits you as a judge among the tribe's elders? But father, this journey will benefit me regarding the job that awaits me, I assure you. That is, if you do return. Son, no one has ever left Tanja and returned to it. Oh, my dear son. Traveling is full of dangers, and I can't afford to lose my only son, regardless of the benefits. But, but, but father, you must let me go. You will not travel. Do you hear me? I forbid you. <clears throat> oh, dear God, what should I do? I need to find a solution. I need to convince them of the necessity and importance of my travel. <laughs> Father, wait. What do you want, Shams? Well, I, I... I want to accompany you to work, my beloved father. All right, son. Uh, uh, father, I know what you want. 
The answer is no. You will not travel. But father, please listen to me. Listen to me, and I promise, if you'll give me a chance, I will be able to convince you. However, if I happen to fail to do that, then I will not travel for the rest of my life. Say what you want, but make it quick. Beloved father, it's been a while now since I've been having this recurring dream of traveling far away. And God help me, I've been resisting this dream with much difficulty for your sake and my mother's. However, I met an old man who happened to be working at al Karawiyi Library. He told me all about his travels and how beneficial they were for him. Please, father, I beg you, I must have your blessing. Hmm. You did not succeed in convincing me. Hmm. All right, during my travels, I will try to gather an enormous fortune and knowledge as well. You know, father, I read in one of the scrolls all about the wonders of pearls. I will gather beautiful, precious pearls, father. My dear, dear son, we do not care about jewels or pearls. All right, then. I will be practicing to become a judge for princes and sultans in nearby lands and return back. Hmm? What do you say? Hmm. Maybe. But you are needed here at home most. Uh, then I will... Uh, I will do a pilgrimage to Mecca. Oh, that's enough of you. Leave me be, Shams. Let me think about it. Tell me, dear, what do you think of your son's travel plans? Let him travel, Abu Shams. He won't be away for long. I'm certain of that. He seeks to learn so much. Oh, all right, all right, I see. Oh. Oh, God. I know I can't prevent him for much longer. Dear God, please help me. Guide his fate and mine to goodness. May God be with you. <laughs> Shams, my boy. Let's get going. I will accompany you to the city borders. Okay, dear father. Tell me, father, why are we moving so slow? So that I can stay with you for as long as I can, my boy. Shams, be safe. May God guide and protect you, my boy. Always remember, regardless of the amount of difficulties, that the solution is always closer to you than this bird that has crossed our path. And with this, Ibn Battuta departed his country, as a bird would leave its nest, heading from Tanja to Telemessan. Na 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 na